All right, you guys. I feel like I need more sleep, but I know I want to get up and get going to Blue Willow to get a skillet, so... Okay, that walk, that 10 minute walk did not wake me up at all. At all. I don't know what the nurse practitioner was talking about. It did not wake me up at all, guys. But yeah, um, that's my meal. I'm gonna give myself 30 minutes to eat it and uh, go back to sleep until 11, I guess. Alright, and then this one's me. One thing too in the morning is not talk to me. <laughs> so we're kind of like batting the zoo around here. There's only like two stores open, and one, one of the stores we never go in. And honestly, I almost said this was cute if it was Miss and Miss, but then I realized it's a religious store and I'm not going to have gay stuff in there. So, we're going to go Juicy Pennies. Hey Maddie, what do you tell the haters when they want to talk to you? Maybe later. Okay, you guys, um, I'm just, uh, I'm just gonna lay down for a while. Come on, Eeyore. I have to poop though, I think. What were you expecting today? Um, let me show to you here. Um, uh, oh, wait. I gotta exit up full screen so I can get Amazon up here. Wait, I get Amazon, Amazon. Doot. I think I got used to you sitting next to me. Yeah. I know I didn't like sleep great either. Well, should have more. Gave you a key, you know I can use it. I should have. That was stupid. Table for tea? Uh, actually, we uh, were gonna ask you, is this still the right picture? Yeah. 
We're gonna ask you if you remember seeing this kid here about six months ago or so. Uh, no. Table for two? He's with another guy. Maybe we can look at the security cam footage. I'm like definitely not allowed to do that. Come on, dude. Yeah, okay. Um, all right, look, I got. I'm not gonna eat and, uh. I'm having such a good time. I'm having a ball. Don't stop me now. I wanna have a good time. Just give me a call. say that true divas aren't really mortal. They're more like the Loch Ness Monster or, or Smeagol. Divas walk and yeah. they talk. Man, I still feel tired. Hi, guys. I'm eating the leftovers of my skillet. I thought we already checked this box. And um, I'm going to fight my tiredness and just clean the silverware. So... Um... Clean up the kitchen a little bit too. I need these to be more than fine. Okay, I need them to be perfect. They have to be perfect. Sorry if this is dull day today. I'm just a. I think it's chronic fatigue. I let go. I did that already. You know, I said that. What were you thinking? You said turn, so I turned. I meant into the parking lot. Look at my headlight, Adrian. It's nothing. Nothing? It is totally smashed. Look at that. Hello? Yes, he's right here. Now? Okay, we'll be right there. Stottlemyre, he says it's very important. No! No! Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna what? watch another Buffy episode and then go back to sleep Sand. for a little bit. I am so tired and then I'll work on nope. cleaning the silverware, Hi. okay? Are you jealous? Oh, Sandra, around. Please. He's just a kid. Ah. Cordelia is so fine. You know, she be just perfect for us. Don't be an idiot. She's alive. This shouldn't take long. I'm probably the only girl in school who has the coroner's office bookmarked as a favorite place. Hi, sorry to interrupt your little undead playgroup, but I need to ask Willow. She'll help me with my science fair project. It's a fruit. I would have asked Chris to help me, but then that would have brought back too many memories of Daryl. I found it. Meredith Todd died in a car accident. Hi. Yep. We're running out of time. Honey Nut Cheerios. I'm very tired, guys. Again, sorry about this all day. I really want to clean. I really do. And I'm gonna do a hyperlapse outside my window, I guess. We can't just keep waiting around for another lucky accident to drop ahead in our laps. And yeah, guys, I might want to take a shower afterwards and then I'll. Um, clean this silverware and whatever else in the sink. And then, um, if I still don't feel this great, like how I am feeling now, I will save my room for tomorrow. Yeah, I will, um, clean my room, um, tomorrow then if I still feel like shit, like how I am right now. Sorry, I got cut off. Alright, um, Buffy is almost over, probably in five minutes around there, so hyperlapse next.
No, oh, cheesy Louise, you guys. <laughs> what time was it when I fell asleep? I can't remember. I'll have to look back. <laughs> but yeah, um, my kit arrived for the toolkit. Well, I'll show you on a clear video. But I want to show somebody else, Brenda, too. Yeah, give me a few minutes to get dressed again and um and pee. I gotta pee very, very, very bad. So it'll be filmed on my uh well you'll see. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, hi you guys. Well, um I'm dressed again, so I have bring Eeyore in. I went pee. And so I'm going to show you what I got. Okay, um, yeah. I decided to film this way so it can be clear for you. Look. This is parts of what I got. See all my beads? Like one, two, two. Because it got pretty full. Look at that. Two and two. Three. And then... I'll fill up four. This is five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, some of it is upside down, so. Um, I got that. And, okay, this is what I want to tell Brenda about here. This is what confused me. This is what I was telling her about. See this? I was like think I was like shown on videos on YouTube videos that you can pick up the diamonds through the here. So I tried that alone and I'm like it's not picking up. So I had to dab some wax on there and then it picked up. This is like three. You can put three on here. Just do the same as you would do right here, but you'd have to pinch some and then push them in there like that so that's what I really wanted to show her and still you got to be careful with this because this kind of like pours so if you wanna shake the diamonds you gotta go like this so no diamonds can you know so that's what I wanted to show you so um, and Jean Highland if you're watching, look away, because this is going to be the gift for you. I want to have it be a surprise. Brenda and whoever else is watching, continue. This is what I am doing. See? So this is the fives. It goes like color by number. It's only diamond with, with numbers. Or color, okay? Like color with diamonds, I mean. See? So, um... I've been practicing with just this, three at a time, see a few F's right here, three F's, doot, 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 and then I can do two F's right here, and then I can go boop, okay, two or three or whatever, but yeah, I'm just going to practice with this one right here, um, so this is the one what this came with. So, okay. Um, I got a film soon for my daily video. So I'm going to do a little bit more of this myself. And pour more diamonds in the packaging. See, okay. This is like 19. And I'll do 19. Okay. So, uh, 18, 17, 16, 15, and so forth. Some of them has a lot in there, so I might have to do like what I did for 2, 2. Okay. See, I wasn't using 2, so I had to fill it up right here. This is 2. This is how much it comes in. 
these packages. Okay. Whatever the color is, like, okay, two is, number two is what now? It's D. It's all these Ds. Okay, all these Ds somewhere in, on here. Sounds like somebody is, uh, So somebody is mom on or something. But yeah, um I'm gonna do some of these while I'm watching YouTube and then clean up the silverware what I wanted to do and everything. So mm-hmm. So alright. If you still aren't comfortable Pinching this closed where it pours. You can use the one that it came in with your diamond art itself. Okay, that's another hint I wanted to share with you. Okay, I'm shutting up. See you later. See you around. Okay, it's 414. We don't have any food here, so that's our only choice. So I'm like, okay, have it resent from the same restaurant, that's fine. And they would like pay for it on that, right? They wouldn't make us repay for it. Anyway. Another half an hour goes by, it shows another guy going to pick up our food. And I'm like, great. Second time's a charm, you know what I mean? I think it's supposed to be third time's a charm. We are the Thrivers. Women with metastatic breast cancer. Standing in the struggle. Hustling through the hurt. Asking for science, not saris. Our time for more time has come. Living longer is possible and proven in women taking Cascali plus Holdestrin for it again. Um, cut that out. No, I, I heard the voice again. Stop, Bridget. I'm tired of it. Seriously. The voice said. No, I don't. The voice said that's it for today. Thank no, you the, no, the voice never said that. The voice actually said something bad is going to happen in tomorrow's vlog. again was the first one into work and he was walking down that hall into work where he was painting and there was a radio on the wall that never ever worked he walked past it and it turned on full blast and that scared my dad senseless he thought somebody fixed it I guess so he flipped it over checked for batteries there weren't any batteries in it in fact it wasn't even plugged into the wall my dad was a bit creeped out by that. He didn't tell us about that incident until the last one happened to him. Does she have like borderline personality disorder as well as alcoholism? Not that I'm trying to diagnose the parent. Anyway, long story short, we were chatting about it and he was like, the one thing people don't recognize Katie, and he's like, I don't know if you are aware of this, but in order to be an alcoholic, 
when you have alcoholism because it's a mental illness, right? So it's a disease, There, it's an addiction. Changes can steal the person that we used to know away from us. It, it becomes narcissistic. And I was like, what? And he was like, yeah. And he goes, I believe all people with alcoholism also have narcissistic personality disorder. And I was like, explain. And so anyway, and I don't know if you hear the helicopters, and I apologize if you do, but police, I'm doing their police. work and do things remotely away from a lot of stimulation and people um look into that check it out because i don't i do not believe that you're going to have to just be stressed or not or be excluded i think we have to find situations and certain career paths and things that that benefit us and don't overstimulate us i don't believe it's mutually exclusive okay so Look into that. And I know that someone had shared in the comment below this how they had changed their job and it made all the difference. And I know that this might not be the easiest time for you, but if there are certain things like, oh, we're gonna have a group call at 9.30 a.m. or whatever, um, you know, maybe. Yeah, guys, I'm gonna go to bed within the hour, okay? I have been tired all day. Oh my god, you mean like a Okay, guys, going to bed now. I'm all ready. And no hyperlapse, okay? Good night. Mm-hmm.